<laughs> hey, what's up? Going on? This is the ride share forty. What in your life led up to this? Um, like I've always enjoyed people. The person I've been around so many different personalities and characters of people growing up in Baltimore. And I was just like, I'm doing ride share. I'm like, it allows me to interact with people from different places. I was like, why not use this? I mean, to me, it just made sense. And it kind of take the concept of being a truck driver. Travel, stay on the road. You're in Nova Scotia yes, for the I first am. time. And what yes, better sir. place than Peggy's yeah. Cove? Peggy's Cove, really nice area, really nice weather today. So. What is it that you said that you want to try here? Uh, we want to try the fish cake and chow chow. Uh, slice of gingerbread cake and rappy pie. Uh, rappy pie. Okay, right. Right. That's a that's a Nova Scotian thing. So, want we'll to try as many things, dishes as possible. This is a nice, messy sandwich, just like I like it. So tell me about what you've had here so far. Poutine, ketchup chips, dill pickle chips. I've had lobster, beaver tails, moon mist ice cream. Oh, garlic fingers. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. It's delicious. I like the chow chow. I like, you know, when you go somewhere and people are welcoming, you know, people treat you like family. Those are places where I enjoy. I can just strike up a conversation with somebody, you know, get to learn about somebody else. Those are places I like. I love to travel, meet, and then to have a meal. <laughs> yes, sir. How's it going, buddy? Very good. This is my first time trying this, so I'm, hey. I'm extremely nervous. This is a very old dish, about 250 years old. Wow. Yeah. That's how old the recipe is? That's how old the recipe is. Oh, man. Wow. So how do I eat? Is, and what is... Yeah, so a lot of the Acadians of Nova Scotia, they'll drizzle a little bit of molasses over the top. So what's in it? Is just potatoes? And... Yes. It's rehydrated potato with a chick in, in a chicken broth, but it's the texture of this pie that's very different than any other dish that I've ever had or seen. Someone told me that this has an acquired taste, and I can see why. You but know, with this molasses... It's... The way I view the states and just, you know, human beings in general is just a family of people that just need to learn more about each other. Yeah, having food is a great way to do that. How you guys doing? Awesome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yes, Neville. Did you do, uh, what is it, half oxtail, half jerk chicken? And that's what I love when you're trying something, especially if it's your first time. I want to try things that, you know, is a part of that culture or that's ingrained in that, you know, that uh, community, where, wherever town I'm in so I can experience it, you know, firsthand. This so good, make you want to check the menu again. You're like, <laughs> what else they got? <laughs> you know, like, I want to see my country. I want to learn about America, you know, how things are, what people eat, and how it is in different places. So I'm able to accurately describe it when I go to go visit somebody else's country. And it kind of be like that ambassador for the States, you know? <laughs> you know, and like I always tell people, when I'm traveling places, remember, it's not about being invited, it's about being invited back.